Canadians looking to apply for most COVID-19 benefits or even check the status of their applications are out of luck this weekend. The Canada Revenue Agency is doing what it calls routine maintenance. It's happening at a time when many Canadians are already having trouble getting the help they need. Abigail Beeman reports. We regret the inconvenience. Disappointing. Jordan Rago was getting the CERB. Now he's applied for the new Canada Recovery Benefit. The application process opened Monday and he's had no luck, just an error message. It doesn't provide me any information as to why I'm ineligible. Uh, there is not even a follow-up from that error message that's provided to applicants who apply online, uh, where, you know, what the next steps are, if they have to call, which department to call. Um, and yes, uh, from what I understand, uh, I am eligible. He's dealt with dropped calls and long wait times, and he's not alone. Hundreds posting their frustrations with the system in this Facebook group. Making things worse, no one can apply for any of the three new benefits right now. The CRA site and phones down for a full weekend for routine system maintenance. The CRA wouldn't comment on the timing of this outage, but told Global News in a statement, some applications are not immediately approved, and in these cases, individuals are receiving messages to call the CRA. This is because the CRA is performing more upfront verification to help ensure that CRB payments are being issued to individuals who are eligible. Rago says he was never told to call anyone. So far, the CRA said it processed more than 876,000 applications for the three new benefits. The others are the Canada Recovery Sickness Benefit and the Canada Recovery Caregiving Benefit. Almost 600,000 of those were for the CRB. It hasn't said how many more people are having issues applying. If they had extended CERB, at least until after the scheduled maintenance, the people who right now are calling in, trying to get a hold, can't get a hold of anyone while they are worried about being able to keep food on the table, being able to pay for rent. You know, this is totally unacceptable. Opposition MPs say they've been getting lots of calls and emails too. The Conservatives blame the Liberals for proroguing Parliament, delaying the process. We would have had at least six additional weeks to beta test, make sure we had all these programs. But as it was, unfortunately, the government put the civil service in a very difficult position and that has left Canadians behind. It's been challenging, to say the least. The CRA tells Global News that only this Thursday did it begin sharing applicant data daily with the different government department that handles EI. The error code Rago and many others received is related to this. It's 026, and the CRA says anyone who got that code should try to reapply again on Monday. Abigail Beeman, Global News, Ottawa.